Hello Taurus, welcome to your daily love guidance reading. This is Chelsea and thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate your love and support. Taurus, please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time and energy is fluid, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently or in the future. Roles can be reversed and it is not gender specific. Okay, Taurus, let's find out what's going on with your love situation. If there are any um, messages of guidance for you, okay? Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate love messages for Taurus today. Bottom of the deck is the strength. Ooh, nice. Taurus, wow. Actually, I love I love your spread here. Um, got the Queen of Pentacles, right? Smack in the middle. So this is actually Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. This is Earth. So this is you. You're doing really, really, really well, okay? I'm seeing um, on the side note for those, um, uh, when it comes to your finances, I feel like you are doing really well if you don't feel like you are i feel like you are going to be doing really really well in your finances you know career and oh my gosh look at this it's absolutely beautiful you've got the ten of pentacles and you've got the queen of pentacles this is the queen of money right and she takes care of her um her family she takes care of her finances also very independent okay the ten of pentacles Oof. Gosh, Taurus. But the Ten of Pentacles could also mean money from, um, it could mean legacy. It could also mean inheritance, okay? And also we've got the World card here, Taurus. It looks like um, things are going to change for you. You're going to close this chapter. You're going to close this chapter and for the better. And it looks like you're going to meet the Emperor here. Feel like, Taurus, this is a new love for you, okay? In the past, I feel like you have let go of a connection here, okay? The lovers in reverse. You have let go of a connection, um, maybe because somebody could have lied, could have cheated, or, you know, they put you in a third party situation. And also the four of pentacles here in reverse. It looks like you are, you, you, you have, I'm sensing you have let go. If you don't think you have yet, I think you will. Um, you will let go of this connection here. Um, what I'm seeing with this connection as well, it could have been, although the lovers, okay, if you look at it, the lovers, the name, the lovers, yes, you guys could have loved each other. But also at the same time, the lover's card could mean a choice between two, okay? So maybe a choice has been made to let go of a certain someone or a certain connection here, okay? Love connection. And then while you are just taking care of yourself, taking care of pentacles, focusing on yourself, um, and actually close this chapter, a chapter from your past here, okay? Um, Possibly a third party. I don't know why I'm seeing that because the lovers could also mean a third party situation, okay? Someone just, you know, had an affair. Uh, I feel like you found out about that. I mean, again, roles can be switched. It could either be you or the other person, but I feel like you have found out about that and then you decided to isolate yourself and just, con just focus on, you know, what's more important to you okay something that's more tangible something that's more solid so while you were doing that i'm sensing that you know you slowly you were closing this chapter from your past um a past love connection that was poss possibly not really that healthy and i guess that was why you made a choice to let go of it okay however as you were doing that as you were letting go and just focusing on your work on you know your money even on your family because the queen is a, a mother um, whether you're a mother or not okay it doesn't really matter but it's just focusing on things that are to you at that point um, is more important or right now this could be happening to you right now and while you were doing that I feel like you're slowly closing that chapter um, and letting go completely of this past situation or this past person and that's when 
you find your Ten of Pentacles and the Emperor right here. Um, the, t the Emperor is someone who has, um, uh, what do you call it? who has an em empire, empire, right? He's got a lot of money, especially when he's like, doesn't matter he or she, it's not gender specific, okay? But with the Emperor sitting right next to the Ten of Pentacles, oh my gosh, okay, so this person, um, Taurus, if you haven't met this person yet, this person is going to be in your life like for a long time, for a very, very, very long time, okay? Because I, I don't know why I tend to see this, the, uh, this guy's hair. That's the father, okay? And his hair is white. And his hair is white too. So it's to me, it means longevity, okay? It means something that is definitely long lasting that you can actually grow old with this person here. And on top of that, being really, really stable financially. And I love the Ten of Pentacles. This is like my favorite card um, when it comes to career or, or in um, love love situation because this means it's not just about lovey-dovey like those cups love feelings and you know wands which is you know it's great um in a sense that wands there are passion chemistry and all that but then if you want something long lasting this is the card you are looking for to um, appear on your spread and i love it i love it Definitely, I can see that you are letting go of the past here and you are closing this chapter. And as you're doing that, this is when you're going to meet this person that you're going to spend your lifetime with, which is the emperor. And this person could be a little bit older than you are. It depends, okay? I'm sensing the Queen of Pentacles is you, but again, roles can be switched here, okay? But either or, both of you look absolutely beautiful, okay? The uh, only difference that I see is maybe one person is slightly older than the other person, not very much older. Um, usually, the Empress uh, perfect match is the em Empress, but it doesn't matter also with the Queen of Pentacles. Uh, it's just It just means a younger version of the Empress. So I'm sensing someone here is slightly younger than the other person, or, you know, it may not always... Um, it doesn't mean like there is an age difference. It could also mean that um, emotional maturity. But I feel like both of you are mature, definitely, and both very, very um, stable, okay? Because Queen of Pentacles, this is an earth sign, right? Earth is it, it's stable, it's solid, as well as the emperor. The emperor is already well established. He is emotionally mature and he knows what he wants. He's very experienced, but of course the emperor is very firm. Maybe a bit serious sometimes, but I feel like both of you are a perfect match regardless, right, Taurus? And we've got the strength card here. So it looks like, um, to me, you've been really strong. I feel like overall you've been very patient, you've been very strong, and you've been sort of like um, maneuver, maneuvering your life the right way even after an ending here like you 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 sort of regroup yourself and it's like not everybody can do that a lot of people get lost in the midst of heartbreak and you know uh, breakups or endings but you, it didn't happen to you like that Taurus you just regroup yourself and you just um, started to prioritize your life and know what's like more important for you it's like amazing, Taurus, you're so amazing here. Yeah, I definitely can see that. And this is why you deserve this emperor here. Or well, the emperor deserves you. Both of you, you know, it's like this This past should have ended um, for the better, of course, because we've got the major arcana. The world is a major arcana. And it means you clo you're closing a chapter and starting a new one for the better, actually, for the better, especially with the rest of the cards, surrounding cards right next to it. It's absolutely beautiful. All right, Taurus, this is your reading. I'm so happy to see that. Um, please take care. And oh, okay, I uh, forgot to mention, I do private reading as well, but only emergency reading. My information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me. If nothing else, I hope to see you tomorrow as I post your video uh, almost every single day. Take care, Taurus. Bye.